Now, there's one crucial thing to say, which is that it's really tempting when you're working with any workstation to assume that the way that volume management is best done is simply to grab the volume faders at the bottom and to adjust those. So in other words, I could achieve an, a sort of a, an equilibrium of volume across these three sounds simply by grabbing the volume faders and turning them down a certain amount. Well, that's not the same as controlling the input stage. What we're doing within Omnisphere, for instance, is we're basically saying, okay, this signal is overloading, and what I want to do is to stop that happening at the input stage. That's different from this signal is overloading, and the way that I'm going to address that is to turn its volume down at the end, keeping all of that overloaded signal in place, but simply reducing its volume. In other words, if I get distortion as a result of the fact that the sound is overloading at the input stage, I'm taking my distorted signal and I'm turning it down with a volume fader. That doesn't get rid of the distortion. If I want to get rid of the distortion, I need to change the sound at the input or gain stage. And that's what gain staging is, making sure that at the input stage, we're regulating volume across whichever channels we've got within our project.